Hey, I just came back up to grab a few things. Come on, chop, chop. Yeah, yeah, I just need to finish this press release, send it off to the word processing pool. Fine, you tempt fate. I'm going back down. Give me 30 seconds, I'll be right there. Does it bother you that all the folks up here could be incinerated, but you and I won't? It does now. Culling of the herd. Well, the truth is, if we're down there long enough, we'll be cold, too. Food and water will eventually grow scarce. In a week, we'll be eaten. Of course, most of us will succumb to microbes before then. It's an awful way to die. Huh. A swift end might be preferable. Why don't you go ahead? I'll just see you down there. Suit yourself. Hey, do you mind? Go for it. I know you took the bat, Lior. It's fine. You got a second? Half a second. What's up? Something interesting. The president's incommunicado, so I was reassigned to the EEOB. You know who else cleared your decks today? The VP. None of that is interesting. OK, well, this might be. A source saw Darby in the East Wing a few hours ago, so I played a hunch. The rest of the cabinet, everyone's suddenly off the grid. Do you have a question? Why is the nation's command structure meeting in secret with the president at the White House? I can neither confirm nor deny that. You just did. This is newsworthy, Seth, along with the fact that the speaker's 500 miles away. You'll find out how newsworthy if you don't get back to me before the end of the hour. 